Hello, and welcome to History Ridiculous. My name's Andy Green, and with me, as always, is Miss Betty Jean Green. Today we're going to be talking about inventions. Before synthetic plastics were invented, a substance called hemocyte was widely used to make everything from cash registers to telephones. Its ingredients are blood and sawdust, which sounds like a Metallica tribute band. Duct tape was invented by Vesta Stout, a factory worker during World War II and the mother of two sons in the Navy. When her supervisors at the factory dismissed her idea for a stronger cloth-based tape, she wrote a letter to President FDR, who then ordered Johnson & Johnson to manufacture the idea. Alexander Graham Bell invented the metal detector to try and find the bullet lodged in President James Garfield. The device worked, but had interference from the metal springs on the bed. The chief physician only allowed a search of the right side of the body, and the bullet was on the left side. Oh my god, you hope they get the metal detector right when they need to invent it to find a bullet inside you. Jesus. I know, biddies, it's crazy. David Dunbar Buick was a plumber who invented the process for adhering enamel to cast iron. Clearing the way for cast iron bathtubs and homes, he would later start the Buick Motor Company. Jeez, why don't you just stop inventing stuff? David Dunbar Buick. One invention per lifetime. My God. And the Tang Dynasty, uh, Dynasty 618 to 906 AD of China, was considered the Golden Age, and they invented gunpowder, made the first gas cylinder, had air conditioning, and a way to print books. You had me at air conditioning. Anyway, that's going to do it for History Ridiculous. If you uh, like this show, for whatever reason... And uh, you enjoy Biddy Jean Green's meows, you can always click subscribe. We appreciate it. Thanks for watching History Ridiculous. Hope you have a good rest of your day or week or whatever it is.